I write this as I prepare for the most treacherous journey of my life. I don't know if I'll survive, but I want to record this just in case anybody wonders what happened to me. After a severe storm, I found myself adrift at sea. I'm not sure how I survived, but I awoke upon the shore of a small, uninhabited island. With no food, I was left to fend for myself. I fashioned some spears out of nearby plants, hunted crab, and built a fire to cook my food and keep me warm. I had hoped the light of the flames would signal for help, but nobody came. Hours turned into days as I learned to live off the land. I even built myself a small yet cozy home to keep me safe from the rain. But despite my best efforts, sometimes things would go wrong. Luckily, it was on the island that I met my new friend, Rocky. He was the first person that I got to talk to in weeks. His sense of humor is unmatched. You wouldn't believe how hilarious he is. Rocky not only kept me company, but he taught me new skills like fishing. I don't know if I'd be here today if it wasn't for him. But I long to return to the server. I still have unfinished business amongst the land of my friends. I have to return. I tried to convince Rocky to join me, but he refused, trying to convince me to stay. As tempting as it is, I have to go back, so I gathered some materials and fashioned a raft. I'm going to set sail now in hopes of returning to my home. If I don't make it, tell Rocky I said thanks. Rocky, you changed your mind. I knew you wouldn't let me take this journey on my own. Let's head out. We made it! <laughs> Greetings, friends! Chaos here. It feels so good to be back on the TerraCore server. Welcome, welcome. It has been far too long. I hope you guys enjoyed that intro. It was just a little bit something a little bit funny to make fun of the fact that I've been gone for the past five months or so. But as I said, this server has been active. So in today's episode, which by the way is episode 16, we're going to be checking out the server, some changes that have happened to it, particularly with Dante, who has built an entire theme park. We're also going to be trying to take on the Duke Fish Run because even though we have not fought Plantera yet, other people have already fought the Duke and I'm feeling weak, <laughs> so to speak. But first, I do have a big announcement. Today is the channel's third anniversary and that is so exciting for me. I cannot believe that three years have already passed since I first uploaded a video, and that is absolutely insane. Thank you all for sticking around and helping the channel grow as much as it has. I had another video planned for the anniversary, but because of power outages and stuff in the past week, it's kind of late, and I'm hoping to release that video on Halloween instead. But today, the anniversary, we do have a special announcement, and that's going to be plushies. Again, but this time, a new one. That's right, Makeshift was kind enough to reach out to me and set up a brand new plushie design in celebration of our third year for making videos. To change things up, the plushie design this time is wearing my steampunk vanity set. This adorable little guy goes on pre-sale tomorrow at 5 p.m. Pacific time over on Makeship. There's a link to that in the description below. Same as last time, we have to have at least 200 pre-orders for the campaign to be fully funded. The campaign will run up until November 19th. And same as the last design, once this is gone, it's gone for good. I'll have more information on them after the campaign begins in my next video, so stay tuned. So once again, those plushies go on pre-order tomorrow, and that's going to be around 5 p.m. Pacific time. 
So if you guys want one, you will have a couple of weeks to pre-order one. And there are links to that in the description below, as well as the pinned comment. So if you'd like to help support the channel, please pick one up. As far as this episode goes, we're going to go straight over to the shopping district and we're going to check out not only our shops, see what sales we've made, but we're also going to check out Dante's amusement park. Here we are at Dante's entrance to his amusement park. And I'm going to give you guys a tour, just you and me real quick before I hop onto the server with everybody else to play some of the games because they've all seen this already. It's going to be pretty loud, pretty noisy. And I thought I would give you guys a look at this impressive place first. Now, I do have to admit, I'm not a huge fan of isometric builds. Well, I mean, I like the way they look, but not when you're walking through them because it feels a little twisted. However, I do enjoy the bus. The bus here is meant for us to store all of our stuff in because his games tend to kill you a lot. So, yeah, we need to be safe and sound, but... Let's zoom out so you can get a full feel of this place. And let's check this place out. It is really impressive. He's put a ton of work into this. So this is the first game that we encounter. And it's called The King's Jump. Just let's hide that there. And just look at this. He's put a ton of work into the art on this. Just the title of this alone looks fantastic. And so basically this mini game right here is something that you'll go down into this tunnel. It's going to launch you high into the air and you're going to have to land on some floating islands up in the sky and win a prize depending on what you've landed or win nothing if it's already been looted. You never really know. Then over here we have yet another mini game. And this one, I actually don't know all too much about. <laughs> it looks like it's a torch god tower because of all of the torches on the side. I don't know how that's going to work because some of us have completed the torch god event. Some of us haven't. I have not. So this might work for me. I'm not sure. But he will be giving us a tour. We'll be playing all of these games. And I'm curious to see exactly how that's going to work. Then we have the iris wheel. And this is supposed to be not only a Ferris wheel that sends you round and round, but also a mini game. Okay, so yeah, this is going to be a mini game where we have to fight the Eye of Cthulhu. Well, not really fight him, more like try and survive him. So we're going to be in this Ferris wheel, if I could actually jump in there. There we go. And we'll be teleporting around the Ferris wheel, trying to avoid the Eye of Cthulhu. So this one will obviously be done at night. I'm very curious to see how it goes. It should be pretty interesting. The theme park continues over here with the Bloody Mollusk, which is yet another mini game where it's a bar fight. Everybody gets to sit around, drink ale, and then we get to eliminate each other with it. <laughs> So this entire theme park is obviously on a pier at the edge of the world on the ocean. And he's just done a ton of work and all the detailing here. Like this little fishing boat just looks fantastic. Everything here looks fantastic. I don't know if he has more plans over here. It kind of looks like he does. So he might not even be done with this entire place yet. But man, it just looks so good. I'm eager to get into some of the games with the others. So let's meet up with everybody and get into some shenanigans. So there's Luke like the way, okay. <laughs> there's nothing to there. another episode of Home God. Reviews. It's been there's so long there. since I saw any of you. <laughs> no. It's been so long. I need to start recording. No, say it again. What? <laughs> no. I should you probably missed start my stream then. It's been so long since I've seen any Yeah, I've, I've been we've... stranded for so long that my only attack is... Um... Wait. We're just gonna go this way. Guys, can we repeat this segment? <laughs> I wasn't recording. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Holy it's shit. No, so no. Long. Give it a second. Let me start Look, look, first. look, oh look. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Wait, listen, wait for Kuja. Listen here. Listen here. Only the true businessman will have the full recording. Yeah. 
stars. Five and a half look, 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 look. So. I want to I wanna introduce you guys to my new best friend. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't. Is it? His name is Rocky. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> you can't do Wait. that with those. It's not a rolling cactus. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> that was too easy. No. Rocky, that was inappropriate <laughs> touching. <laughs> Literally, the first five Great minutes we're about back, to guys. for, I have died three twice. <laughs> uh, I missed this. You should die. Chaos. Chaos oh, is, okay. is like a kid at a theme park. You always lose him and he gets like lost in somewhere. <laughs> yeah, every kid at a theme park has a gray long beard and short uh -huh, shorts. So relatable. <laughs> Such a kid thing to have. I like the way this yeah. looks though. Uh, you guys played so this. Short. You guys played oh. this before, but I didn't really get to Wait. because my internet was bad that day. I remember. Uh, yeah. So what you do? And luckily, I've already redone some stuff. Just head on through that door. I don't have anything on me, do I? Oh, oh door. this door. Uh, no. Oh. Interesting. Oh, yep. Horrible. Okay, I, I guess I'm going here. on an adventure. Wait, oh, yeah. You do don't I, even need to, where like, do I pay? The, you actually don't even need to take the Flamingo Mollusk thing. You just need to use it and then... Oh, yeah. Damn it. Thanks. Oh. Right, is anyone gonna raise me? Oh, damn it. Yes, I'll raise you. Go. Ready, set, right. go. Wait, no, wait, the, no, 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 and... no, no, no. But did you <laughs> go already? Yep. Okay. I went. And don't forget to hold up. I am holding up. Yep. I slowed down I'm... massively, but there we go. I'm going fast. Yeah. I had to grapple. Am I gonna overtake <laughs> Chaos? No, I'm already out. Hey! 99 mana crystals! I could you. just pay 30 <laughs> mana crystals Wait. to take this. He got the prize. <laughs> well, one wow. of the main prizes. Well, I don't want to play anymore because Chaos got the best thing already. <laughs> so this <laughs> is what no, Grave Diggers so feels well, like. Gambling sucks. <laughs> Right, we want to do a, a race to see uh, who can go oh. the furthest to the left. Uh, what do you want to bet on it? I'm gonna join the blue uh, team. Oh yeah, we probably oh, should do that actually. Great question. Man. But green That's is put better. A casual, a casual 35 crystals on it. All right, I'll bet okay. you 35 crystals that I go further go. to the uh, left. Uh, all right, sounds good. Let me good. just remove sounds some stuff. Okay, like are you ready? Window. Apparently, no shadow. Are you ready? Uh, yeah. I'm gonna drown. Hurry up, go. Okay, go. <laughs> go. Aww. Okay, I'm fast, man. We got the potion fish. Excellent. Yo. What? Okay, what sauce left, did right? you? Yeah, for this to the left. You... I feel like you took something to go that fast. No, I oh. haven't. I can share my recording after. <laughs> oh, you bonked! That sucks. Oh, you bonked! You bonked! You so lucky! Okay. Oh, I am definitely gonna win this. Wow! Okay, let's that pull up so the map. Bad. Let's pull up the map. I am How so far oh. ahead of you. How did you go past that? I I, I started hard. going. I started going left earlier, but since you were going faster than me, you you bonked it. Oh my god, yeah, wow, is being better like is actually being worse. <laughs> no, but wait, Chaos, I have a cool trick. So if you right click oh Feather god. Fall, it will actually like be better. Oh yeah? I, I just mm -hmm. slammed into the side of a floating could, island. That kind of sucks. Could you like, try right clicking it? Uh, yeah. It's not doing anything. No. No, I'm going to land on this platform. Why is oh, it always a blood was, moon when I play? I don't yeah. know. If you all okay, want, I landed no, right I here. Hold on. I, I want to see I how win. much I can just rub in this victory over Geis. Wow. Okay. You can stop now. Nope. Uh, nope. Nope. But 
Are you done? Nope, I'm still like going. I'm still I'm, I'm still I'm still moving on my end. Oh, uh, the map is just not updating as fast. I'm almost landed. It's a good thing Kishin's here to protect me because I don't have what? very many so weapons. Much further. Whoa, Wait, I almost, so almost, much almost there. That's where I landed. So I, I, I only beat you by a little bit. Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Okay, so the rules here are very simple. Using the levers to your left and right, you can go clockwise or counterclockwise around the trams. Using this, you will want to dodge something that's very mean and angry. You want to be the last one alive in this ride in order to claim a wager prize. Let's Sorry. go. Sorry, Kujo. Last person alive wins. Start the jail. Oh, no. Go to the other side. Stop. Why did this eye just... Oh, wait. These are ones that can go through the... Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, oh, I'm no. safe. <laughs> Why me? Why is there smaller eyes that can go through the walls? <laughs> I fell through the. I fell through. I fell through. Oh god. Oh god. We forgot god. to close all the doors first. Why me? Oh heaven. Oh my god. Oh, I, oh, oh no. there goes Cujo. They're all focused on me. There oh, goes no, the. <laughs> they didn't do anything. No. Why would you have this <laughs> You're just a biblical angel. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> oh gosh. And you can just dump Certain your stuff problems. in the, uh, one of the chests. Some of the chests. Okay. Oh! Oh, look, I got to the top of the tower. Do I win? Yes. That's how simple the game is. Let's go back. Kujo? Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit the switch. Oh! Uh, oh! There! What? All right. Oh. Okay. And, uh, okay. If you want, you can set your spawn to the bed here. Oh, I no. do want. That's like, uh, probably a good that's idea. That's all a bunch of building oh, stuff. Infinite. There, yeah, that's nothing. All right, and um, I keep getting the pig. So drop the pig. Oh, there we go. Oh, we're on everyone's the side in. of the world as well. Um, did I zoom in for right. this? So yes, yeah, zoom all the way Someone in. Someone hit the lever. We go now. Ah. Wait, I don't what's know the... who hit the lever, but also oh, don't. No, there's imps. Well, take away your summons, please. Oh shoot! Go, 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 go. Oh, go, we're not supposed to be fighting back. I see. Uh, I forget the way here. There's spikes! Oh. Oh. Dude, oh I played a parkour on Pedwin server for like... Oh my god. Years at a time. I bet so Kujo like... dies first for flexing. <laughs> oh, go, 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 go! Oh. Hi, Chaos. Hello. I didn't notice the spikes oh my at first. God. Oh, How far do we need to go? Everything I moved to is the spike. Ow! Oh god, I fell. Oh no, this last part is insane. I there's meteor not doing great. Right. There's meteor heads! There's meteor the meteor? Head? Oh my god, <laughs> what's the <laughs> meteor head? Oh my god. The Why would you do this? <laughs> yeah, but... No, 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 we don't. Chaos, you just picked up all of my gear. I don't care, I just want I'm to turn this... a lot of aggro. Infernal machine off. I'm following Chaos. That's a funny. that's a terrible idea because the a bad idea. the imps. I'm going with it. <laughs> I'm oh, I got so in you. Please it. save me. Choose protect me. Eyes. I have all the meteor head sacks. That didn't work. No. What did I? Okay. I'm being well, spawn I'm camped. <laughs> okay, I dr I'm, I'm it oh, stuff. God. Ow. <laughs> Why is there so much? What is wrong with the imps, man? Can somebody have a conversation with the imps? They're just getting a bit out of hand. <laughs> you think a again. conversation would solve it? Yeah. Having a conversation now. Hey, <laughs> words are stronger than, than anything else. That was rough, but a lot of fun. I probably won't do the torch one again, because that one was a little insane. But the amusement park was a blast. Now, I need to go and kill the Duke, because I found out that a couple of people were picking through my storage in the five months that I was gone. Kushin and X-Men. And I decided to get revenge on... I'm busy. Shoo! I decided to get revenge on Kushin. But, uh... she She's kind of geared up a bit in the five months that I've been gone. I would... I, like, nearly got her with the Zappinator, but she teleported away. <laughs> <laughs> Man.
Might I, um... Finish her. <laughs> Kushin? Kushin. Oh, gosh. You touch my stuff, and then you have the audacity... You have the audacity... To sit here and use overpowered weapons on me because I've been out of the game for five months. Hey, Chaos, wanna join blue team for, for a second? Okay. <laughs> I need to kill the freaking Duke. As you can see, that didn't go the way I planned. So I'm gonna go try and defeat the Duke. Let's see how it goes. So <laughs> I have. Come over here to the ocean on the farming world, and I've built a bit of an arena that hopefully will help with the Duke. It's been a very long time since I've done this fight. I'm probably horribly undergeared for it, but I've got nine truffles. I've got another one back at the base, um, so a total of ten attempts. I'm going to give it a shot real quick, see how it goes. If I need to do more gearing, I will. But the idea is I just ride along here and I attack the Duke as I go. I don't know if this is going to work, but I'm certainly going to find out. We're going to give it a try. I'll buff up as soon as we catch the Duke. I'm quite nervous about this. Here we go. And away we go. Oh, of course. First thing I do is not get on the right mount. <laughs> All right. Let's see if this arena will end up helping me or hindering me. I'm not off to a great start, but... Oh, no, 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 no. I rammed into that block with the campfire. The time has passed, and I've done a fair bit more preparation. I've only got eight attempts on me at the moment, uh, but I do have some new weapons. Again, we have not fought Plantera yet, so we don't have ideal weapons for this fight. But I'm going to try it a few more times, see if I get lucky or if I get skilled. We're also on the other side of the ocean right now, and we're going to be fighting this where uh, Heiss and some others have set up base already. So we've got platforms to work with. We can dodge and move around a little bit better than we could before. So hopefully this helps me out rather than having a rail where it's guaranteed he's just going to fly right into my face, right? So, for the most part, I think I'm going to be sticking with the Spirit Flame, just, uh, possibly. But, uh, we're... I don't know. We'll see. I'm also wearing the Hallowed Gear now instead of Titanium. Am I? No, I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> I meant to, but I forgot to switch it. That's okay. We'll, we'll use this. Oh, we're already doing a lot better than we were. Dodging Tornadoes. But, of course, we're not even in Phase 2 yet. And that's where things will start to get hard. Luckily, I've got a decent set of wings. I've got decent mobility. Falling through the platforms could be a little bit faster for me, but that's okay. Can heal in five seconds. Or I could walk straight into that platform and get myself killed. Man, I really wish you could hang heart lanterns from platforms instead of solid blocks because that block is absolutely the reason I got killed there. But I think I might have this. I gotta spend another 10 minutes reorganizing my gear, of course, but uh, eh, I'll be right back.
Oh my god, that was so close. I was one hit away from death for such a long time there, but I finally did it. He has been slain. Oh my god, that was such a pain in the butt. I'm going to have to do it more than once, but I'm very happy I got that done. I only managed to get one heal off because I didn't take damage for most of the... Uh, the beginning half of the fight and the reason why I wasn't talking there is because you guys have all seen this already so you know <laughs> we got Senex's set again I feel like that's the second time I got it of course we got a ranger weapon not the best shrimpy truffle obviously uh the relic obviously so I might be able to trade this ranger weapon since I'm currently playing mage or maybe I'll start switching over to range I don't know uh, let me know in the comments what you guys think. In the meantime, I think I'm going to farm this boss a few more times. Alright, here's the hoping he doesn't hit me during phase 3. Don't hit me during phase 3. Oh no, my nose is itchy! My nose is itchy! Oh, no. Won't scratch nose. Won't scratch nose. Won't scratch nose. Oh my god, why are you making it worse? Uh, she's so I'm mean to me. My nose right now. It's so uh, nice. It feels good. <laughs> I sc the second it died, I scratched my nose. <laughs> oh. oh, do you have a do you have a name now, Blue, for your new channel? Um, uh, Kushin, it's on you. Don't die. Oh, I died the second he did. <laughs> hey, <laughs> Blue, good. guess what? How does he kill me right as he die every time? I don't know. Why is this? Why do I have to sacrifice my life <laughs> and convenience for him? All right, let's see what we got. Okay, here's your godly flurry on their pad. I got the Razorfin Typhoon wings in my first bag. Are you just randomly nice. placing banners all through my tree. Wait. Yes. <laughs> The typhoon and the I'm the also bag. putting Halloween yes. costumes in random oh my containers. My second bag got me the bubble gun. I mean, nice. you could put Halloween costumes nice, on like random nice. mannequins around the place. I am so happy I was finally able to kill the Duke. And not only on my own, but we got some of the other players involved later on as well, as you guys saw. And we've got some goodies here. Very excited about that. Now, I was editing this video and I noticed that the video that I took of going to the shopping district and going through all of my shops, well, I accidentally was recording the Minecraft uh, source, not Terraria, so it was just a black screen and you guys couldn't actually see anything. That said, I do have all of the mana crystals that I've earned from shops over the past five months. So as you can see here, I have sold an absolute boat tone, boat tone, boat ton of stuff that I need to restock. Uh, Rod of discords have sold some fish gear, a bunch of sales. And I think I have, yeah, I have a little bit of mana crystals in here as well. So all in all, over the past five months, it looks like I've gained about 10 stacks. It's actually been 12. Uh, Bad Scientist is the newest member of the TerraCore server, and I gave him two stacks of mana crystals to start off with. So if we look in here and we add these, that is our current wealth which I'm pretty excited for. I do want to vastly expand on that, but I don't have time to do it just today. But I'm also thinking if we're gonna be rich, can we really just be living on a shack in the ocean? I wanna do something about that. And I think I want it to be themed like our little plushie here. But that's going to be for the next episode. Speaking of that, next episode, we're going to be working on base building. We're also going to be fighting Plantera. So I'm pretty excited about that. And we might take on a solar eclipse after taking Plantera out as well. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. And again, I'm so sorry for the five month break. It will not be happening again anytime soon. 
But if you like the content, please consider subscribing and be sure to check out the plushies while they are available. Again, they go on sale tomorrow at the time of publishing this video. And there's links in the description below. Until next time, I'll catch you all later. Happy building.